Psychology says. Once you have true feeling for someone, it will always be there. You may not like them anymore, but you still care. Ladies, sometimes, you have to let a man, that was never on your level to begin with, go right back to what he is used to. You're not for everybody. The most pathetic feeling is when you get in a fight with someone BC you expressed what made you upset and instead of apologizing they find a way to make you feel bad ABT it so you are left regretting even saying anything at all. Relationship Tip Find someone who still knows how to talk to you when they're angry. Someone who respects you in all mind states. Remember, most of your stress comes from the way you respond, not the way life is. Adjust your attitude, and all that extra stress is gone. The most critical moment in life. When someone very special hurts you deeply, gives tears to your eyes. And ask, what happened? But you just reply nothing. The best piece of dating advice I've ever received is this, if they like you, you'll know. If they don't, you'll be confused. Honestly, it's all you need to know. We are not meant to hold on to the emotions we feel. So don't. Feel it, learn from it if you can, then let it go. And each time it comes, feel it and let it go. Please don't build up emotional content anymore. Build up emotional resilience. Practice the art of letting go, every day. Some people are in your life to test you. Until you stand up and say, enough is enough. I am worth more than you offer me. In a relationship you gotta think about everything with a, how would I feel if they did the same thing to me, before doing any move? That's the part most of y'all never understand. If your girl cries over you about small arguments or cries over you in general. Man, she love loves you and she is all about you. Don't take that shit for granted. It's fine to fight for someone who loves you. It's a waste of time to fight for someone to love you, there's a huge difference. Emotional monitoring is exhausting for both people. Constantly being asked if you're okay or upset creates tension. To heal the pattern we need to trust that someone will come to us if there's an issue. Don't force someone to remember you all the time just stay silent and let them realize how will they be without you in their life. Be with someone who motivates you to do better in life because relationships are more than just falling head over heels in love. It's about inspiring each other much better versions of yourself day in and day out. Imagine you're in a room that is filling with water. There are no windows or doors. How do you get out? 8 signs he is secretly crazy about you. He tries to hide his feelings when they are obvious to everyone else. He remembers even the smallest details about you. He gets jealous when another man approaches you. He is active on your social media accounts. He's always wanting to know more about you. He's looking out for you in a crowd. He sends you random texts or calls you randomly. He stands up for you, even when you are not right. Drop red heart in the comments if you loved this video.